Hi, I'm Ed Rousel, the Conservation Officer with Chichester Harbour Conservancy and today we're in Salton's Copse, which is a site of ancient woodland that we manage. Um, it's the only site of ancient woodland on the Manhood Peninsula, which is basically the Selsey Peninsula of um, Chichester Coastal Plain. And we manage this woodland for its nature conservation value. The management that we do is um, called coppice management. This is an example of some coppice management here in Salton's Copse. Um, we use our volunteer work parties based on Chichester Conservation Volunteers and our Friends of group to do the coppicing. And the, basically the process of coppicing to get this regrowth is actually cutting, cutting the hazel stems off at ground level and then basically with, with hand tools, with um, bow saws and bill hooks, to cut it down at ground level and then the plant regrows from the base in these smaller stems and you get a multitude of stems. As you can see, this area here was coppiced um, last year and this area on this side was coppiced around about four or five years ago and you can see the, the, the growth that we've had in that, that time. So this is an example of a coppice stool that, it, that was cut probably about ten years ago because I think this area is due to be cut this winter um, and you can see the, the kind of regrowth you get and the size, size of stems so these are a good centimetre apart so they could be used for um, hedge laying as, as stakes and then these smaller diameter coppice can be used um, for the heatherings at the top of um, top of hedge laying or for pea sticks and, and things like that but that, that's an example of of the kind of end result of the coppicing so so this would be at the point where you'd re-coppice the, the coppice stool. And you might be able to hear in the background we've got some chainsaws working today. We've got a company called Sylvan Environmental um, doing some work for us in the woodland to thin some of the canopy trees. They're a, a specialist company that, that works on these sensitive sites such as this um, and any of the timber that requires extraction will be extracted by um, heavy horse. So in order to get the timber out of here, that timber that we felled, um, we're going to use a very, very low impact system of extraction and we're going to be using horses. The two horses uh, that we're going to be using in here are two Belgian Ardennes. Uh, the Bay Ardenne, that's a big brown one, uh, his name's Jeton. He's actually 18 years old and he's worked in forestry since he was four so he's done a very very long service and has pulled out thousands and thousands and thousands of tons of timber from woods just like this uh, all over uh, the south uh, up as far as the Chilterns in Surrey and as far down as Wales and Devon. And the other little horse there, his name is Issa and his colouring is a strawberry roan. And one of the major reasons we use horses in forestry today is because of their incredible manoeuvrability. You can get a horse to an area to pick up timber where you simply couldn't get a tractor. Um, in here, as you look round, you can see that we've left various trees standing. So there's a lot of big standard oaks in here. There's some trees in here that might be considered veteran, i.e. they're very, very important in terms of their age and their conservation value. You don't want those trees damaged uh, when you go in to pick up the timber that's on the ground. Now a horse can weave in and out of these trees and get to what we call selectively felled timber, i.e. that's maybe one tree that you've felled over there, and another one you felled over there. So you need to be able to manoeuvre in and out of the trees. They're also very, very low impact on the ground and soil structure, so you get no compaction, you get no ruts. Uh, they're very quiet and, of course, they're a very low carbon alternative uh, to using machine. And this is a very important consideration today in terms of sustainable forest and woodland management. And, of course, uh, they're a much nicer way of working. Thank you.